We'll get it right this time. I'm gonna get it right. Welcome back, YouTube world. It's your boy, Brian Barrel of Valor's Image, back with another video. And before we jump in today's video, I want y'all to do two things for me. And I think you already know what it is. That is, one, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And two, punch that notification bell. That way you are notified when I upload a video. I upload videos each and every week. We talking about style, talking about image, talking about fashion, talking about dreadlocks, talking about men's lifestyle. I might even start doing videos on fitness because fitness is another passion of mine. I've been doing it since I was 14 years old, working out, lifting weights, eating healthy. You know a little bit about it. Might start teaching you guys about that too. Who knows what the future holds? But if you haven't already, do those two things for me. All right, let's jump into this video. So I want to talk about the difference between freeform dreadlocks and twisted dreadlocks and which is best for you. But before I answer that question, let's first touch on the differences between freeform dreadlocks and twisted dreadlocks. So freeform dreadlocks are dreadlocks that are formed organically without the use of hair products or any type of manipulation. The only way to create freeform dreadlocks is to just continue to wash your hair and keep it oiled. Twisted dreadlocks are dreadlocks that are twisted at the root of the dread and you use a lock cream to keep it tightened and it takes a lot of maintenance to keep it looking fresh and clean so basically what you do is you just take a dreadlock and you use whatever lock cream you use and you just you do you take the cream you put it right here at the root of the hair and you just twist it give it a twist and the cream will keep it nice and tight that way it keeps that dread, or the root of the dread, looking nice and fresh. Now, the term dreadlocks was born in the 1930s when a man named Ras Tafari was crowned emperor of Ethiopia. Now, when the emperor went into exile during the French invasion, the guerrilla warriors swore to never cut their hair until the emperor returned home. Not realizing that their hair matched together and locked up forming this unique hairstyle, and because their dreadlocks were thought to be disgusting, frightening, and dreadful, they decided to keep the term and call them dreadlocks. Now, how would you know which one is best for you? Well, that's all up to you. If you want to go the freeform route where it's unkept and dreadful, then go freeform. But if you like the twisted look where it looks fresh and clean, then go that route. Whichever one you decide to go with, just be proud of them, wear it with confidence, and show it off proudly. Now, what if you want to transition from twisted locks to freeform locks? How do you do that? Hmm. It's actually very simple. Just stop retwisting your hair. Don't pull any dreadlocks that are congoing up, and don't do any type of manipulation to your dreadlocks. Just wash it, keep it oiled up, and soon your dreadlocks will look more like freeform dreadlocks than twisted dreadlocks. All right, so that wraps up today's video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and comment down below and tell me which one do you prefer. Do you prefer freeform dreadlocks or do you prefer twisted dreadlocks? Whichever one you prefer, comment down below and tell me your thoughts. And I'll see you guys in the next video.